We'll just start by double clicking our project panel, selecting our image and then pressing OK. Then we'll head over to our None tab, which is our empty project timeline. If you can't see this, just head over to your window, workspace and all panels and you should be good to go. Then select your image and drag that into your empty timeline. Then we want to right click and select a new adjustment layer. From there, with your adjustment layer selected, head to your effects and presets and search for wave world. Then double click or drag that to the adjustment layer. You should end up with these platforms. We want to change our view now to height map and our wireframe controls. So I want 254 for my horizontal rotation, 42 for my vertical rotation, 0.920 for my vertical scale. In height map controls, I'm gonna leave my brightness as it is and I'll change my gamma adjustment to 0.910 and I'll leave my transparency. Heading on down into simulation, I'm gonna change my grid resolution to 92 and then for reflecting edges, it's good to have all just so that we get that nice, dewy, watery render. Then in ground, we're going to change our wave strength to 0.550 and produce a one. We just want to change our width to 0.171 and a frequency, we don't want it to be one because that's a little bit fast. So we'll change that to 0.700. Heading back down to our timeline, press T to open opacity. We want to change that continuous opacity to 20%. You can also have it a bit higher or lower depending on the brightness of your image. Then we'll select our adjustment layer again. At the beginning of our timeline, we will select the timer icon next to position to place a keyframe. We'll just drag that a little bit to one side of the image. Move about 15 to 20 seconds from the beginning of the timeline and just drag that target all the way in. The larger the distance between your keyframes, the slower our dart is going to move. And that will depend on how natural you want your watery, dewy effect to look. We'll just play that back to make sure it looks all really cute. And that'll be all for this video. If you enjoyed this, please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!